H E L L O E V E R Y O N E. Here's another episode of Worst Album Ever Made. A uh, show where we are still trying to find out what is the worst album ever made. Now, I've been busy for a little bit. Unleashing 100 mile an hour winds. I've been without power. I've been without water. And I have survived Hurricane Sally with only one thing on my mind. Colin Langinus, uh, The American Dream, Living with the Rock. A little bit right after my last review, I, I took a trip to a local record store, uh, and the, I, I, when I go to a record store, I don't know what I'm going to find, but I always look for the most unique covers, and then I'm going to buy it and listen to it and see if I found a uh, hidden gem in the rough of so much well-known music. Uh, and uh, this time, I found this, and I instantly bought it. What a cover. My God. <laughs> now, I found Colin Langinus' The American Dream, Living with the Rock. I found it in the punk section, and I, I think it does belong in the punk sec section of the record store I found. But at the same time, it has some very uh, big folk inspiration in it. Uh, and my God, is it a, a weird little beast. Uh, so we're going to take a look at it right now. This album has 20 tracks on it and they can range from a three minute song to very, very short little things. Uh, four seconds, 21 seconds, 17 seconds. Uh, there's a lot of just second long songs off this album. A lot of punk can be very fast and to the point. Uh, for case in, in point, like the, the Descendants, Dead Kennedys, Angry Samoans, they can do amazing things in a very short time frame. I mean, uh, the Angry Samoans have a great song called Coffin Case, and that one's like barely any length at all, but I feel like it's a perfect, perfect little chunk of music, I wouldn't know what to add to it. So just because a song is short does not mean it's going to be a bad song. But when you have 4 seconds, 6 seconds, 10 seconds, 17 seconds, 5 seconds, and 21 seconds, all of those different tracks on this album that's only 20 tracks long, uh, you probably are going to guess like, why'd you even make a full length album and print it and put it on CD? I don't know, Colin wanted to put it on here and I commend him for doing it. So, we're going to uh, take a look at uh, Colin's, uh, Colin's 2005 piece, uh, Living With The Rock. Rock. Now, since the songs on this album are so short, um, I'm only going to highlight a couple of songs because I'm, it, this is what the first song was like. And I don't really think a synopsis is needed for that specific song. So I'm going to jump around and give you some of the best, the best little bits from this album. Uh, and the first song we're going to talk about is going to be 2012. Colin was ahead of his time. This is 2005, and he's talking about the end of days that was eight years ago. 2012, they're at it again. The Mayans predict the end. Hebrews 2, the end of the calendar, a legend like Cortez. What you gonna do? What you gonna do? When I think back at 2012, I'm just like, things weren't so bad compared to now. So we were just like coming up with ways that we will probably kill ourselves. Uh, but here, uh, it, it's just it's such a wonderful little bit. I love, I love when people talk about 2012. It's, it's almost nostalgic. I love it. Next song we're going to talk about is Police State. Now, I'm, I'm not going to hear and, and say that this is peak punk. It, 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 is, it is very aggressive, it's 
it's home brewed, it's a sound that gets the message out of your head. And I think that in itself is one of the things that makes punk so cool, is because punk does not have to be clean, it does not have to be perfect, it's punk. Uh, it is loud, it's aggressive, and it's, it's making you grab you by the edge of your seat and just saying, pay attention, listen to what I'm trying to say to you. Jesus! Listen and pay attention. I am trying to get that message across. And I think it does that very well. The next song doesn't do that. That's AIDS in Africa. Such a small, bite-sized little piece of ear that is just, just blasting in your ears. Now, if I do not think this is just saying this just to say it, I think there is meaning to him doing it. And I do believe that him saying AIDS in Africa is because he wants people to realize, hey, there are people dying of AIDS in Africa. We probably should fix that. There could be no concept that he could have just wanted to say it, but because of the police state song before it, I think AIDS in Africa is more than just ear rape for no reason. Okay, next song really, really plays on the Tony Hawk boy, I Am. Okay, I, I, I really like this song. I really do. Colin sounds like he plays a lot of underground clubs and he plays for a lot of punks. So this is uh, his exact words. Give the punks what they want. Better play just like the stereo. You gotta play the same old songs, angry, or we'll walk out. Disease is in the sky if you are looking. Give the punks what they want, want, but they won't like you. And he's just like, I'm, I'm tired of it. I play the songs, I do it, and everyone says I suck. Listen up. Listen, I'm talking to you, okay, punks? The one that freaking bought this record? Hey, shut up. I'm gonna play whatever I wanna play. Okay, now we're going to get in some absolutely wonderful, worst album ever made territory. We're talking about Expunge, baby. Uh, Expunge is this uh, folk uh, little song that's been hidden in this punk record so far. It's the first one of the folk songs. And um, it's silly, it's ridiculous, and it keeps getting more ridiculous the more you listen to it. But Expunge is uh, a wonderful thing because it's just so ridiculous. It's just so ridiculously crazy. Uh, a, two, a two pee poo people zoo, needles balloons, knee jerk baboons. All in time, that's right, I expunge my lunch, hiccup, burp or, burp, or fart, medicine, tarnation, wet trees, burn, botch, and spurn, bald eagles, stern, hard to fix, broken, oh why? What the fuck does that mean? What the hell is that? does this, does that mean? are now at the magnum opus. The whole reason I wanted to cover this album is not just because of songs like Expunged telling you about just the songs of this album. I want to show you rock and roll. I'd like to give thanks to the creators, to the inventors of my native tongue. Rock and Roll is a song that's like nothing else off the album. This album has had punk and has had folk, and now it's going to be diving into hip hop. Blood is spitting shit, much in the bounce. Anything that makes a move, I'll take it now. In something that sounds so unique and so ridiculous, it is freaking crazy in one of the worst best ways possible rock and roll 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 
rock and roll, rock and roll, rock and roll, rock and roll. Rock and roll, 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 rock and roll. When I first listened to rock and roll, I laughed so hard, I smiled so wide, and I loved every single minute of it. I love showing people rock and roll. It is, it is. <laughs> Like the room levels of hilarious, hilariously bad. Love was howling, he'd forever bowling. I was on the rock and roll since I was crawling. And most motherfuckers, what do you know? Truth be told, ain't got no flow. I want to blare this in my Kia Soul with the windows rolled out, with the bass on high, rolling down, and 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 just see everyone's faces. I want to do that so bad. The more music you listen to, the better you at understanding what good and bad music is. And this is one of those experiences. And I want to share that with you because rock and roll is an amazing song. <laughs> so I don't think it's gonna go on the board. I think Colin is a pretty okay dude. I haven't heard anything otherwise. Uh, I'm sorry that this has been a short episode. I'm trying to get back in the swing of things. Losing power for like a very long time really kicked me in the teeth. So I wanted to just do this a little practice, getting back in the swing of things before I talk about my next subject. So I'm going to leave you here and uh, I hope you all have a wonderful, wonderful week. Thank you for watching. Oh my god, I love you all. Thanks for staying with me. And in the description, I'm going to show off Colin's new music. Uh, but this is Living with the Rock, Colin Langitis, and I hope you have a wonderful day.